Harris Gang. Good morning, Harris Gang. Guys, y'all know today is Wednesday, mental Wednesday check-in. Wednesday check-in, and I'm ready to check in because your girl is stressed, but we gonna, we gonna check in this morning. Baby Five just woke up. It's like 7 a.m. in the morning, you guys. And yeah, so y'all already know what today is. But before we get into this video, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Make sure y'all hit the bell. Make sure y'all write Danielle. Y'all, we leave on Friday to go see Danielle. I'm so excited, but I had a scare and I'm going to tell y'all. So this is going to be a quick mental check-in, but I'm checking in with y'all. So yeah, just stay tuned. Let me get five hits breakfast. Say good morning, Harry's gang. Good morning, my family. <laughs> All right, Harris King, stay tuned. King. So as y'all see, y'all remember I had an up down. So y'all know I'm going to visit Danielle. So I'm just getting the up down. I'm just getting the ponytail part redone. So I washed it already. And now all I'm going to do is just put some conditioner on it. And then I'm going to let y'all see what's going to go in fives. I look so crazy, but it's okay, y'all. Y'all know Coco for I'm going to let y'all see what's going in five suitcase. And then, in the Talk to Us Thursday video, we had to figure out what's going in Coco's Okay, So, look, y'all. Y'all see the up down is still in there. But I have to put the conditioner because if I don't, then I comb my hair out with a big comb. Okay. Just to make sure. There we go. So boom, the conditioner is in there. Let me wash all this crap my comb. And now I'm gonna go take y'all into five room so I can show y'all what's going in his bag. And don't forget y'all. So let me tell y'all why I'm stressed out. So y'all so, when I went, I checked my email last night, but I was really checking for the login information. I mean the check-in information for when we fly out or whatever so why they cancel my visits i was stressed out like when i checked it it was very late so i didn't upload a video because i was so stressed out because i was trying to figure out why was my video like that but anyway you guys i mean why was my why was my visit canceled so when i call today they do have a lot of outbreaks but the pod that danielle is in has no outbreak so as long as Tonight we go to sleep. The next day we go to sleep, we wake up and they still don't have no outbreaks. We're fine. So I'm just praying and hoping that when we get out there, there's still no outbreaks and we could still be <clears throat> seen because if not, we would have flown to Sacramento for nothing. So anyway, you guys, of course, we got to let him wear his Halloween pajamas. He only need one pajama because we go, we fly out there tomorrow and we come back Saturday. So he's only going to be sleep once. So those are the pajamas we're going to take um his outfit that he's gonna wear to the actual visit is either gonna be this one and it's just like a little orange sweatsuit that i got from walmart y'all know i love walmart and if he don't wear that one and he's gonna wear his halloween dunks with that one if he doesn't if he doesn't wear that one he's gonna wear this one you guys walmart my favorite with these shoes remember i showed y'all these little shoes and um um i can't show y'all his halloween costume i wish i could you guys but these are the shoes for the halloween costume and he's wearing this on saturday to the visit so yeah and then that's basically it i have his shoes and his socks right here and then i have an outfit to go underneath his outfit um when we go to the visit so this is going under his costume just in case he doesn't want to keep it on if it's too much and i have some black socks for him as well so I'm going to go ahead. And then sometimes, like, I just got to bring an extra outfit because the prisons be tripping, you guys. So, yeah, I want to do my mental check-in with y'all, but just give me a second. Let me put all five. I'm going to put his socks in his shoes. Woo! Y'all, I was up working. Watch when y'all see downstairs. I got to feed five. My mom was washing, and she hang dry all her clothes. So my house looked like a cleaner's. And then we're going to bring these extra socks. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these right here. He doesn't need, last time I overpacked and it was just a hassle for me because I was so tired. And then let me sneak his Halloween costume over here. Boom. And I got him some white t-shirts. Let me show y'all, hold on. All right, y'all, so I'm back. So I wanted to show y'all the t-shirts because as y'all know, I usually buy five of these t-shirts from Walmart. It's all stained up because 
they ran out i guess the one i went to like three walmarts i could not find them anymore so i had to go to the next best thing y'all five wears a 2t 3t so i buy him the hanes t-shirts look let me let y'all see the size where is it so those are the t-shirts that i wear like under his clothes or just like on a regular day i just let him put those on you guys as y'all see i cleaned up his room and that's his clothes over there that he's gonna wear but i just came here to like check in and let y'all know how i'm feeling mentally so when they canceled my visit i was like in distraught because like i didn't know why they canceled the visit i hadn't talked to danielle so i'm thinking like dang did she get into some trouble or something like that you know when you're in a relationship like when you're in a marriage and a person is incarcerated ow and you can't like really they like the system could do whatever they want to you like you just feel like you're at your lowest like you know and that's how i felt like i was at my lowest so um i have was like very like depressed and then I'm, like i told danielle and she like got down when she finally called me she's like i don't know why the visit got canceled let me call so she i mean let her go talk to the um lieutenant so she when she talked to the lieutenant the lieutenant the lieutenant did say that the prison might get shut down because i have to sneeze okay the lieutenant did say that it might get shut down because they have like a lot of covid cases but her pot that she's in has no covid cases so i woke up early this morning and i called down there they basically said we're good and that gto had a glitch if i had a visit for this weekend and i'm good and they got the paperwork but the side note that the the guards basically said was but keep in mind that if anything changes overnight that your visit will be canceled and i had to stress to that officer like yeah i understand that's fine i said but do you know like we're flying like we're over 200 miles away from her so we're flying out there and she was basically just saying it was nothing she could do and this is danielle y'all hello this is Tell link. You have a prepaid call from... I think I have a booger. Danielle Harris. An inmate at the Folsom Women's Facility, Folsom, California. This call and your telephone number will be monitored and recorded. To accept this call, say or dial 5 now. Thank you for using Global Tail Link. Baby, say hi to Harris Gang. What's up, Harris Gang? She just woke up, so her breath is stinking. We'll be back. <laughs> but um sorry the camera had cut off but as y'all see i'm so stressed my face breaking out but like i don't know like when it comes to Danielle, my mental health really just be like up and down like i'll be so glad when um she comes home i think i told y'all that her date changed again to november 2024 at first it was all the way in 2025 y'all didn't went to december but i know it's gonna go to january or december 2023 so y'all just continue to keep us in y'all prayers as y'all see five is already messing up he got his broom right here i haven't swept yet but he got his broom his dustpan and he playing with his abc i tried to sit up here and teach him how to put them on there but you know how kids be y'all so coco get her hair done at um i'm going to get my hair done today i was going to wait but i'm gonna get my hair done today you guys but that's gonna be in a different vlog um i'm just getting my up down fix stop five no 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 trying to mess with my internet no i'm gonna go downstairs i'm gonna feed him some um oatmeal you want to eat eat you want to eat eat he said yeah so we're gonna go eat some food you guys i'm gonna like get him together <sighs> y'all don't understand i just feel so much better now that um like you know we for sure going out there and I can't wait for y'all to see our pictures because they were trying to battle me last time. And now I know like I could wear tight clothes. When I went last time, I wore very loose fitted clothes because I know how prisons can start tripping on you. But when I got there, people had on like one pieces, tights, jeans and stuff. And I'm like, wow. So I honestly got to get it together. So I'm about to go through my closet. I didn't buy nothing new. I bought five some new stuff, but I didn't buy nothing new because I'm always buying these new clothes. This just looks so nasty. Comment down below what I could put on my bunk because I put some toothpaste and it didn't work. But yeah, Harris Gang, like, I'm happy. I love y'all. I really thank y'all for supporting us along this journey. And I can't wait till Danielle come home so we can have our new baby, y'all. But yeah, y'all. All right, y'all. All right, y'all. I know I'm looking crazy, but I'll have to come finish it up because y'all know when I get on the phone with Danielle, I'll be so happy, you guys. 
So I'm feeling better now. But anyway, you guys, like just your loved one being in somebody else's custody and you can't really make decisions for them and them being able to tell you when and when you can't see them, that will stress you out. Like I was at my lowest. I didn't eat all day yesterday. Like I was so stressed out, y'all. I just wanted to come on here and just bring a awareness. Like mental health is real. Like no matter what it is. Like and I feel like I was battling with my mental health yesterday. Like my mom was here, so I didn't really have to like do too much for five and I just thank God for Mama Coco because I was just so frustrated because you know we barely see each other. We see each other once a month, twice twice a weekend but once a month so i was stressed out but i'm feeling good y'all so i'm gonna wash this conditioner out my hair you guys i'm gonna find my clothes and then the next video is gonna be like probably talk to us thursday or something and i'm gonna come over here and i'm gonna pack our bags because we is going to sacramento y'all we going to sack but, all right harris gang i love y'all baby five love y'all most of all then you'll love y'all